I'm a streamer, okay? <laughs> Which means I get this special gay fucking privilege of being immune to most of society and most of things that happen. Like, even my own drama, I'm a relatively immune to it. Like, it happens, things, things go on, and at the end of the day, it's like, no, nah, I'm good, though. I'm triply immune from societal drama. Like, what the fuck? They, they have to cancel me. I've made myself effectively cancel-proof, and it's fucking great. I wouldn't trade it for anything. People try to fucking cancel me all day. That's what they're going to do. Okay, they'll do it. They can't, they can't do it anymore. I signed a deal with Rumble and Locals, baby. I'm so fucking hard to cancel. I would have to like, I would have to fucking, uh, I would have to like murder puppies on stream. I would have to do something horrendous to get canceled at this point. Fuck you, you tranny weirdos. Fuck you, Minnesota legal board. All of you fucking loser, faggot, bitch, cunt, whores. Try it. You can't do it anymore. I made myself... I've inoculated myself. I injected myself with all of the ivermectin you could find. I took some in the neck. I took some in the ass. Ivermectin everywhere. You can't fucking do it anymore. I found a way to be goddamn uncancelable by you fucking lunatics, okay? But most people are not. Most people are not cancelable. Or uncancelable, I should say. Most people are imminently cancelable. Most people have real jobs. Most people have real life. Most people have real obligations. I have real obligations. I've just found a way to mitigate the impact of my stupidity on those real obligations.